Tonight will be a very special night for the Ursay family at Marion University. The Ursays are not only known for owning the Colts, but also for a long-standing commitment to the community. Our Angela Morian joins us live from Marion with those details and a special guest as well, Angela. Drew, Phil, as you said, what a special night this will be for the Ursay family here at Marin University as they are honored in the circle of honor here for the Knights. But there's going to be another inductee into the wall of fame here for Marion, and you'll recognize her as the current Purdue women's basketball head coach, Katie Gerls, who joins me now live. Coach, thanks so much for joining us. You're known for Purdue right now, for Purdue in college, but you spent eight years here at Marion, won two NAIA national championships. When you walk into this gym, what memories flood to your mind? Uh, those red banners hanging, um, countless memories with the, the kids we coached, um, a really, really good eight years, and uh, Purdue was going to be the only place uh, that would steal me away from this place. Um, this place will always have a special hold on my heart, but um, once a Boilermaker, always a Boilermaker. <laughs> we were talking about this gym before we came on. It looked a lot different when yeah. you won the two national championships. How did your legacy and your teams that you coached build this gym up? I think everybody wants to support winners, right? Um, and we were able to win some win some games, win some championships, uh, get good players. They, they make up for a lot of dumb coaching to, to kind of hide all that. But uh, just collectively, the community of Marion, um, obviously probably started in football, right? Football won a championship. Um, they win another one. We won the same year. We went, we go back to back. Volleyball wins. Just the, the, the community um, here at Marion is really special. Um, and, and those eight years are years I'll never forget. You're going into the wall of fame as the winning coach in Marion program history what kind of honor what does this honor mean for you tonight I really can't put it into words I think about um, my staff throughout the years um, Vicki Lake and Mark you know everybody that that stood on the sideline with me and then all the great players that played for us um, like I said like it's there you know my job is done in practice but it's them you know for 40 minutes when the when the lights are on and they're the ones making all the plays um, uh, they made me look good and um, they uh, they got me a, a pretty good job up at Purdue and and uh, forever, forever grateful for them. I'd be remiss if I didn't ask about the Purdue Boilermakers' first trip back to the NCAA tournament in five seasons. What was special about your team this year? Yeah, just the, the entire year, how much we believed that we belonged. Um, obviously, it had been a while, and uh, for me, that's crazy. You know, Purdue should never live on the bubble. Purdue should always be in the tournament because um, that's the way it used to be. Um, hopefully, you know, last year set the the standard. Um, we got a, got a taste of it, um, and, and we're hungry. Um, we got a group that, that believes we belong and um, hopefully no more living on the bubble. All the key players returning for your Boilermakers as well. Coach, thank you. Congratulations on the honor tonight. We'll have more from Coach coming up later tonight and the Ursay family also being honored. Hear from them coming up at 6. Guys?